Hi, this is Eugene McGuinness, and you're watching me on Tiscally. Hello Eugene, welcome to Tiscally. Hello. How are you? I am well. So you're fairly new to all this. Yeah. So how long have you been in the music industry for? Um, the industry, I don't know, maybe about a week because the record came out about a week ago. That so I suppose technically I'll be in the industry for about for a week. week. But I've been playing gigs and things for about a, a year and a half. So uh, yeah, a long time. So you're, how do you feel about your debut record coming out? Is it a single album? It's very strange. Um, it's, like, um, it's like a mini album. Okay. Uh, so it's very weird going into the shops. And I have been doing that. I, I'm, I'm not acting very cool. I do go into the shops <laughs> and I, I see that it is there. I would do that. Um, I'd be looking and going, oh my god, this is Yeah, I just stare at it and <laughs> kind of walk, walk out again. Yeah, it's really weird. But it's cool. Yeah, it's wicked. Um, did you write all, do you write all your own stuff? Yep. And yeah, yeah. Um, it's all pretty random. The stuff is pretty strange and kind of all over the place. But From vampires to weather and all sorts. So yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't actually write about vampires. It's just the song title is just really random and rubbish. I couldn't think of anything else. <laughs> but um, yeah, it, it, yeah, the music is pretty random. It's good though. Everybody should buy it. Maybe buy it repeatedly. Maybe buy the same record. Yeah, so just tell them out there. Yeah, yeah, buy, it, yeah, buy, it, yeah, buy, buy the buy record. It. Buy it. Loads. So what's Need your money. what's your sound? Um, it's sweet. It's fresh. It's silky. Easy. He's used to doing that, aren't you? <laughs> Straight there, no exactly. Yeah, exactly, no nonsense. No, you yeah, know, it is random. Uh, it might be an acquired taste, like halloumi or something, <laughs> or or you might. Well, I love halloumi. Yeah, so I'm, I'm or sure maybe everybody know. will love it. I don't know yet. I don't really know, but um, yeah, it's. We'll just see how it goes. I just drop it like it's hot. <laughs> you can't stop me. Are you um, quite surprised about how it's all happened for you, or is it something that you think you know? I've been oh, working so hard, it was bound to happen. Well, yeah. Well, I have been working hard, but it is always kind of uh, overwhelming to s whenever you see it's the type of mu whenever you do music it's the type of thing that whenever it does start to pay off no matter how hard you work at it I think yeah, it's still amazing to see it you know kind of whenever you start reaping the benefits it's kind of it is still kind of overwhelming because all the people that you admire you, you, you start to realize you're kind of you know you're starting to make the same you know the headway that they're doing and just hopefully I can I can keep doing it hopefully who do you admire? Uh, Lionel Richie, um, uh, Bomb Funk MC, uh, and I-465. No. I can't say I've heard of those last two. <laughs> <laughs> trying to be pretentious, but if anybody <laughs> knows who Bomb Funk MC oh. is. They did that song, um, Freestyle, uh, Rocker Rocker Microphone. It was a really good song. Okay, there you go. So you know who he is, everyone now. Yeah. Probably I think it was Bomb Funk MC. I don't know, I might have made that up. <laughs>